Hey guys, Eric Cowley, your publisher of Great Lakes Scuttlebutt Magazine. I'm excited to be down to the Miami International Boat Show right here in beautiful South Beach, Miami, and I am having a blast. One of the best shows I ever get to go to. While I'm here, I'm wandering around, I'm looking for some fun and exciting new product to report to you guys on. If I got something that is absolutely news breaking. I'm here with my friends from Ilmore. Mike, how are you, my friend? Nice to meet you. Yep. Nice to see you as well. And John with Ilhatu. We were together just a couple years ago. We were, well. we were. This is really cool. John, you guys have got some exciting news from Tohatu about this beautiful engine behind us. Tell us a little bit about it. So this is a 6.0 kilowatt, 48 volt system, new to the market for us product that we just come out with in partnership with Ilmore Engineering. And so it's a totally new product. We're gonna be distributing this to all of our dealers in the United States and Canada. So this is 100% electric. It is 100% electric, 48 volt. It is battery agnostic, so that means it can work with lead acid, lithium ion, or anything kind of in between on that system. What kind of horsepower are we looking at here? If you're equating it to a gas engine, you're looking at somewhere around a 9.9 .9 horsepower. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah. And you chose one of the best engine companies around for this partnership. They have great engineering, yes. great technology, absolutely. Absolutely excellent. Tell us about how this partnership came about. I mean, really, it came about, we were, um, we introduced our product, our version of the product about a year ago, and we had some conversations with Joe Hotz, and we really saw a great opportunity to work together, a real vision for the future, clean application, quiet application, and we thought, like, we had a similar mindset, and we're like, why don't we explore this a bit, and so we explored it, and uh, now we've ended up a year later with this great product. Let me ask you a very frank question. There's a lot of people in this competitive space. What makes this engine stand out? I think the one of the biggest things on it is the fact that we have an integrated trim system. And so nobody else at this power level is able to, to trim it without getting an aftermarket kit. And so that's a real big difference here. It really sets us apart. And of course, the styling is incredible on this. It's just a beautiful product. Yeah, uh, it looks fantastic. So sustainability, uh, John, that's something that's been a, a watchword in a lot of different industries. What's going on in the marine space that made you guys think about a product like this that helps the environment as well as gives the boater a fantastic product? Well, both of our companies are, are looking into sustainability, looking for the future. So it's something we all are interested in. We want to move forward. We want to come up with new products that will last through the future. And so this is one of those products that's going to be there for a long time. No, that's absolutely outstanding. So how long has Ilmore been around and how long have you guys been kind of maybe dabbling in some products like this? Is this something that's a brand new venture for you guys? So as a company, we've been around since 1984, but um, we started this project really in an exploratory fashion around 2019 just started really just to try to learn we weren't really intending to sell anything we we're trying to learn the technology knowing that you know internal combustion maybe has a shelf life that we we have to anticipate yeah. and so we just started progressing and then we got so excited about the world we're in and the way the product handled and responded that we just said we got to bring this to market yeah, yeah, yeah. So John, this is under the, Toh the Tohatu brand name. That's right. Um, tell us if I want to learn more about this kind of engine, where the dealerships are that I can go check it out, maybe even purchase it, where am I going to go online to do my research? So you're going to go to Tohatu.com mm -hmm. and then you're going to click on the North American site and we'll be posting some new information on this shortly there. There's a press release on our new partnership, nice. the future of our relationship and our companies, and we'll be releasing this in the f further part of this year, sometime in the fall. Okay, perfect. Mike, when, when John's talking about the future of your relationships, yes. are there plans for a 450 horsepower <laughs> electric motor that are coming out like in the next couple weeks? Yeah, maybe someday. We've heard a lot of response like that, like, you know, bigger power. And so yeah. we obviously don't want to have just one product. Yeah. We want to have a portfolio. So that's the intention of this partnership is we can grow it out and fill in where we think it makes sense. So definitely bigger power. Well, one real quick question, and I, it might be a curveball, but it's the question on everybody's mind. How much does something like this cost compared to a gas engine? And when are we going to be able to find level playing field as far as price points? Is it five years down the road, 10 years down the road, or are we already there? I mean, I think we're close to that. I mean, economies of scale play into this. We, you know, once the volumes start to come up, you can see battery prices coming down significantly. Yeah. So it's, it's all just about getting more of these on the water. And I think in that, 
you know, sub 10 kilowatt field. It's a great application because it's for a slower moving product. Um, it's a it's a great price point of entry for the market. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm pretty excited about checking something out like this in the not too distant future. Um, a boat like this would be what, maybe 15 to 20, 25 feet would have a, a, a nine horsepower motor, nine nine on it. So there's several applications. So one would be a small dinghy possibly, yeah. the remote steer dinghy. How uh, much is this weight? This is 70 pounds. And so then you add oh, yeah. a little bit of weight for the batteries. Yeah. And so you're still just a few hundred pounds total. Okay. So we can talk about dinghies. You can also look at pontoon boats. There's several applications. Yeah. Rental applications this would be great for where you can charge it on a daily basis, that sort of thing. So there's several open opportunities for this product. Well, and the advantage of electric power, and correct me if I'm wrong, but it, it's dead quiet. I That's mean, absolutely. Yeah. Plus, yeah. you've got a fantastic range. Um, you're not spending money on gas. You're just simply yeah. plugging it in. So, I mean, there's a lot of savings that go along with this and a lot of comfort in the use of the product. Well, that goes to the overall cost. So, going down the road, there's less maintenance, less cost of operation going through the life cycle of the product as compared to a gasoline engine that you have to supply. Gasoline, oil, maintenance, those sort of things. So over the life cycle, it actually will reduce the cost of operation. It just, it's a fascinating new world and I am super grateful to know that Tohatu and Ilmore have made a fantastic partnership in order to create this product. So thank you guys so much. I appreciate Thanks, it. Thanks, Eric. Appreciate it. If we it. wanted to find out more about Ilmore and the products that you guys produce, where do we go? Uh, Ilmore.com or IlmoreION.com. You can find a lot of details there. Perfect. And you were saying Tohatu? Tohatu.com. Tohatu.com. Absolutely. Thank you so much. I appreciate it, John. Thanks for the time. Guys, you heard it here first with Great Lake Scuttlebutt. Ilmore.com, Tohatu.com. Find out more about this incredible new engine that they're producing just for you to improve your, your time out on the water. So thanks so much for joining us, and we'll see you soon.